With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, the question given is the wave nature of electron is verified by. Okay, so let's see. First of all, we know that Davison and Zermer perform an experiment which proved that electron is a wave. Okay, so let's see how. Oh, suppose uh, we have here, here we have a source from which electron beam is generated and it is directly connected with the potential. Okay, it is directly connected with the potential, applied potential here. Okay, it is connected with the battery. So here we have applied potential. Now, from this source, from this source electron beam is hit to this metal surface. Electron beam is hit to this metal surface and this metal surface is of nickel. Okay, this is nickel metal surface. Now, what will happen basically from this from this source electron beam is hit to this metal surface and gets diffracted. Okay, electron beams gets diffracted. And what we have here we have a source. Okay, here we have a uh, detector. Okay, there is a movable detector here. Okay, this is our movable detector which detect these electrons. It detect these electrons and produce and it produce a variation okay it produce a variation between intensity it produce a variation between intensity and applied voltage okay so here we have intensity and here we have applied voltage that is root v okay this is accelerated voltage and we get a variation between intensity and applied voltage like this okay we get this variation okay this variation proves that electron is a wave okay so here here this is our electron this is electron beam and it is diffracted by this nickel plate and this move this movable detector is this movable detector is detect this uh, diff diffraction pattern okay these are diffracted electron okay these are diffracted beam so these are diffracted beam here diffracted beam diffracted beam okay and we get a pattern this we get this pattern intensity versus accelerated voltage from this there is proof that electron is a wave this is called division and zermer experiment division and zermer experiment okay first of all it will prove by division and zermer experiment then de broglie is also give us a wavelength of 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 electron wave which is h upon momentum okay so our answer should be division and zermer experiment because first of all it is proved by this scientist okay rutherford is rutherford is not involved in the wave nature okay it is it is proved that it is only used for it is, it is only proof that electron is, uh, sorry, atom is a nucleus, okay, it is called nucleus only. So this is not an answer, only correct option is division and Zermer, okay, scientist. So option number two should be our answer here. Thanks. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.